Uh, Alabella is with us in Silver Springs, Maryland. Hey, Alabella, how are you? Hi, Dave. Oh, my goodness. I can't believe I'm talking to you. So <laughs> good you... afternoon. How are you? I'm honored. How can I help? All right. So my ex-husband and I own a house together. Uh -oh. A year after a divorce, uh -oh. he abandoned the house. Uh -oh. I began making mortgage payments because I was afraid my credit will get damaged if I didn't. So I took him to court, and um, long story short, the court ordered um, to, for him to repay me back the monies I had paid. Plus, he was ordered to continue to pay the mortgage. As of the, the order was uh, effective February 10th this month. Um, as of today, he has not paid. I asked him, and he's, I don't have any money, I don't have a job, whatever, excuses. We are already 27 days late, and I would like to know, other than taking him back to court for failure to follow the court order, what can I do to alert the bank and the credit bureau that I have a court order ordering him to pay? Will no, they even nothing, care? Nothing. You, uh, have, you have a mortgage with your name on it that is not being paid on time period, and it's going to show as negative on your credit report. So what you need to do is you need to have your lawyer put a motion before the judge to force the sale of the house. Uh, th uh, yes, that I, was say, I was going to say I have a trustee right now that is working to place the house on the market. Good. So what are they waiting on? Um, they are just, you know, a few things, like getting things ready. So by the end of the week, we should have it in the market. By, Good. By Good. Sunday, it, it'll and, be. And pay the bill until... Uh, un until if you have the money, if you can pay it, pay it until it's sold. Yeah, I have taken money out of my retirement account, and I know you oh, don't. No, I know. I, know. I had to. I had to. It, it was either that I felt in be You know what I mean? Like I didn't know what to do. Um, mm -hmm. it might what is be, your What is your income? Uh, my income is about ninety three thousand dollars a year. And how much is the house payment? The house payment is $1,693, okay. and I have another house as well. And how much is your other house payment? My house is about, I'm paying $1,700, a flat rate, because I'm adding okay. more, you know, a uh -huh. couple of dollars a month, $1,700. Yeah. I do have roommates that pay me. Okay. How can I help with the rent? Right. But Are you on a really tight budget? I mean, with a tight budget, can you not make both? Uh, temporarily. I don't want to make them long, but just to keep uh, to keep from hitting your retirement account. Yes, I have, you know, kind of reduced my entertainment and my traveling uh, less, of course. I'm trying to... I would cut everything down to nothing and keep it current. And then, of course, have the... Uh, is the house got equity in it? It does. Okay, but have the judge just give you a ruling that you get your money back out of the equity before there's any split. I, I do have that, and okay. thankfully it's, it's in place. But by the time I see any of that money... I will have to continue. So let me ask you this going forward. No, I'm just saying I would rather you talk, get on a beans and rice budget than cash out your retirement. I see. And barely live until you get this house sold. But let's get this house on the market and get it sold ASAP. Uh, what is it worth? Um, the, uh, the issue probably 340 but since my trustee says that, and I, it, will, it has about $60,000 in equity. Good. Let's get it um, sold ASAP. Um, and then, you know, it's just, that was just my only word and my question to you as far as the, um, the, you know, the, the credit bureau. Hey, There's nothing you can do There's when, when a house do. payment that has your name on it is not paid on time, they're going to report you as being late because you are late. Correct. I understand why it's happened and you can put an ex ex explanation on your credit bureau report. If you want that the ex-husband was supposed to pay it and didn't, but you know what? Nobody cares. They don't care. They don't I care agree. because the bottom line is your your credit score is going to go down as a result of bozo here. Yes, I work for the government. I can't have that happening. Yeah. yeah. Um, okay. Well, that that. Okay. So I mean, so, the answer to this is put the house on the market cheap and get it sold quick. I see. Like in two days. <laughs> it, it might take five to six months, according to the trustee. So the that trustee's was my... an idiot. The market <laughs> is not that slow in Maryland. It doesn't take six months to sell a house in our current world in Maryland. Okay, that makes me feel better because I mean, she said, you know, it has to get approved by the by the court. Well, the I mean, there's a panic here. You got you jumped into panic. court already and tell the trustee we're not sitting around waiting. I'm paying seventeen hundred freaking dollars a month. We're not going to wait six months for some judge to get off his robe. Right. No, we're going to be bothering everybody. And so, you know, if the trustee wants to make a career out of this crap, you need to have a new trustee. Oh, gosh. 
Okay. So, I mean, we need to get, everybody needs to get their tail on fire here for your sake. You're the one getting screwed by this whole thing. No, the trustee's not getting screwed. The judge isn't getting screwed. The lawyer isn't getting screwed. Your ex-husband's a bozo. He doesn't care. You're the only one's got anything in this game, right? Mm -hmm. So if I'm you, I'm going to be pleasant, but I'm going to be jacking everybody in this story up regularly. Let's get this house on the market yesterday. And uh, get online and check DaveRamsey.com and check to see if if we've got a realtor that we endorse in your area in our ELP program, our Endorsed Local Provider Program. That'll be a high-octane realtor. And tell them that you need to price this thing in such a way that it's going to sell in a matter of days, not months. And then Mr. Trustee or Miss Trustee needs to get off their butt and get this approved by the judge in 24 freaking hours not in 24 months because they want to keep collecting a trustee fee bs no get this thing done get it done you gotta get out of your life kiddo it's taking you down hey guys thanks for watching if you enjoyed this video click the subscribe button to get the latest content and check out these other great clips from the show